This is WJAR, Channel 10, Providence. There are predictions tonight that E.F. Hutton Company's Providence office will plead guilty to conspiracy and money laundering charges. That word from U.S. Attorney Lincoln Allman today. Three felony counts were filed against the company. Court documents show that at least $532,000 was laundered through the Providence office. The company could face more than $1 million in fines. State police arrested six people this afternoon at the state health director's office. A total of 10 people staged a sit-in at Dr. Denman Scott's office shortly before noontime. For a total of two hours, they protested Scott's proposal for widespread routine AIDS testing. Then police moved in after a warning. So what we're going to do is we're going to give you a warning that if you do not leave, we are going to arrest you. You'll be probably taken up to Lincoln Barracks, at which time you'll be charged and all go before a justice of the peace. And you're going to have to have at least 20 bucks to get out of jail tonight. The demonstrators say the AIDS bill endangers civil liberties and would do nothing to stop the spread of the disease. The six people who were arrested face charges of trespassing.